Okay, so you are installing a standard 15 amp receptacle outlet like we see every day, the most common one you see everywhere. You're looking at the home improvement stores and this seems to be what you're finding. And you're on a 20 amp circuit. You have a 20 amp circuit, which of course is your yellow Romex wire, 20 amp circuits, yellow thicker wiring, uh, 12 gauge wiring, 12 gauge is thicker than your 14. So 12 gauge wiring, 20 amp circuits, gonna be found in your kitchen receptacles, uh, dining room receptacles, anywhere where there's a location where there might be a higher draw. So 20 amp circuit, and you want to install a 15 amp receptacle. If you look at the back of your outlets, virtually all of them say they're rated for 15 amps. And if you look at the slots carefully in the front, a 15 amp outlet has this configuration. We see it every single day. A 20 amp outlet will look different in the front. And when you read the back of your outlets, there's a lot of valuable information. It'll tell you the wire strip gauge size that's required. Um, there's a lot of data on these outlets if you start to read. Um, they'll give you a lot of good, useful information. But the code does allow a 15 amp receptacle on a 20 amp circuit. It is completely safe, completely safe. There is no additional safety risk at all with a 15 amp outlet on a 20 amp circuit. You can do it all day long and you will be fine and you are not violating code. There's plenty of other areas in electrical where it has to be matchy matchy and exactly what the specs are called for, but 15 amps, good to go. Don't do it the other way around. So say you have 20 amp circuit again, and you want the thinner 14 gauge wiring, the white wiring. You don't wanna do that. Your wiring will not be protected depending on how much amperage is being pulled through that circuit. So you want the wiring to always 100% of the time match the rating of the circuit breaker. The wiring needs to always match the circuit breaker, but the outlet, but the outlet, you're good to go. 15 amp outlet, 20 amp circuit, you are good to go. Hey, good luck. I bet you can do it yourself. Okay, let's build something awesome. Let's get to work.